Sorry, but you decide to appear. And I need this stuff, so. Okay, so first food we're gonna do. Bum -ba -dum -bum. No, no, I don't want to pass time. I want to make food. Alright, so what we're gonna put. So we have some pepper, but oh my god, we don't have many actually. We only have two. I know where to get more, but oh, I really thought we would have way more. Oh, I missed. Okay, I'm gonna go get some more. Oh wait, we have the butterfly. I forgot about that. These are warm butterfly. I, I believe that they work as a. Uh, they do work, right? As a. Uh, to make a uh, potion for heat so let's, let's focus on that okay first of all we need ba some basic ingredient which is gonna be a piece of meat uh, I know that you need uh, also a bass then we're gonna need this uh, we're gonna need I don't know if you always need to fill up you know like you can hold up to five items at the same time I'd never know if you sure or not, but my guess is that the more you put, the more hearts it's gonna give, or you know, to your uh, if you put like different ingredient that doesn't have any like special property like eat or faster or you know, giving you some climbing boost. But if I put multiple of the same, let's say for example, I put the two uh, spicy pepper, I'm guessing that it's gonna increase the time, you know, of how long it's gonna uh, work the the food now for the uh the potion we're gonna have to do it with with these because these or it's for potion right cook it with muscle part yeah okay so i think i'm just gonna make one for now uh, do i have any mushroom now we have okay we have this is and i'm just gonna add this to to add some flavor to it <laughs> There you go. For six minutes, 30 seconds, I'm going to feel warmer. Five, six, seven heart. I don't even have three. I have three heart. Uh, spicy meat is too fruit. Uh, giant low level cold resistant. Grand low level uh, cold resistant. So it's uh, tier one, I guess. A filling dish made by cooking fresh seafood and tea meat together. All right. So now we're going to try something else because this here, um, this is the big thing that I really need a lot. It's going to be, uh, this is going to help me uh it's gonna recover some of my stamina so if i'm stuck in the the cliff that i'm gonna big the mountain i'm gonna climb uh this is what you need so if i go with two let's say with this and with this and uh do we have anything else i mean an egg could be good but i'm not mm. stamina recovery effect here so this could be good also for stamina recovery so that means as long as it i know that as long as the food works together like this is a stamina recovery item this is a stamina recovery item these work uh but if you put like say e and stamina it, it won't work oh yeah look at that now we have a full uh green circle which is a full stamina and we have oh my god so many heart it's gonna it's it's well, wow it doesn't give me these art. It just, you know, uh, give me back that much heart, which kind of sucks. Cause if you just need this stamina, then, you know, you you're losing a good uh, meal. So instantly refill some of your stamina. Well, the sweetness of the honey permeate permeate where uh, the the meat, giving it a complex taste profile. By the way, I want to say uh, thank you for everyone who's watching my video on Twitch. I've, I've uh, realized there is an increase in um, in number of people who actually watch them, and I really appreciate it. Um, what's, what is this one? Making dish such as omelette and crab. Um, this kind of, this will have more heart, but we don't want that. This is to have, I don't know what, it's like seasoning. We could try. 
So yeah, thank you very much for everyone who, who take the time to watch my videos. Uh, okay, not bad. Okay, so hiding only one mushroom and one piece of uh, honey uh, that gave us almost a full, but a lot of heart. So what will happen if I put, let's say, two of this and let's make an omelet. Uh, with other mushroom, for example. There you go. So yeah, those who are watching my my uh, video on Twitch or YouTube, uh, when they're 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 put there or when I'm offline, I've 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 seen an increase in in viewers watching it. And thank you very much for watching them. I hope that eventually I'll be able to get to you, catch you guys. Uh, I mean. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, I hope that I'm gonna be able to catch you all like also on my streams, and you know, uh, having um, replying to your comment on YouTube. So thank you very much for that. Uh, okay, so hiding two, we're gonna try three because I'm just curious. Is it gonna have more? So we almost got a, a full circle. Okay, I did. Did we had energizing homelet? Instantly refill some of your stamina. The simple dish is common of all over Iroh. Simply fry eggs until it's nice and plump. Okay, let's let's check. Actually, I know that you can check your recipe. So wait. So that did not made an omelet the last time. Okay, let's see recipe. Bird egg two. Okay, see it actually did work because if. Here, the recipe, I have two mushrooms that give increase your uh, stamina recovery. And we have almost just half of a, of, a, of a circle for stamina. But I've put on this one three instead. And we have more than one fourth. I mean, the three fourth of a, of a circle. Uh, so this one, the difference is that I had an alien shroom. But they they both still have the same number of ha uh, heart recovery, so it's always good to check out. Wait, this one this one is full. What was the the difference? We had two mushroom, uh, two uh, stamina mushroom and one honey stamina recovery. This one we have only one, so that makes sense. So the more you put. The more you put, uh, the more you get. So, and here though, um, I want I like to put variety, uh, but we're gonna go with a full mushroom, just for the sake of it, just to see what's gonna happen. Oh. Okay, just a little bit. So when you hear that sound, it means that you 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 got like look at him, he's all excited, yay! It means that you got a uh, successful or um, very very good. You know, you look at that, he's he's he's, he's all like, this is gonna be so good. It's like kind of a you made a master masterwork uh, recipe, I guess. But it, it's random. I've realized that it's random. Okay, so now we have some uh, for stamina. Uh, we need something for the heat. So this here uh, is good for that. So we're gonna put one, we're gonna test it out. Uh, we need some parts of a uh, monster. So a horn, a fang, and cover with, such, uh, with very short, sharp fur. So much used by itself, but you can mix it with critter to make something useful. So we're gonna also hide this and nothing else. We're just gonna try it out. That's actually do I have anything else that warms up? This is speed boost. This is speed boost. This is uh move quietly. This is attack power, and of course, this is the uh the other one. Okay, so we're gonna try with four. Let's see one butterfly. <laughs> One butterfly, how much can I give us? <laughs> Six minutes, that's a good number. Of course, it's only tier one, but what if I put now two? 
Now we have full hand. Oh. 14. Wow. 14 minutes. Tier one, that's that for now it's gonna be good, but geez. Okay, so okay, and what happened if I put just out of curiosity, if I put three and just two piece. Okay, nothing happened. We got a 10 minutes, so it's not I, I think that actually when you hear the sound, it's not a masterwork, but more a critical success, I guess. So here, if I would have heard it, probably I would have way more than 14 minutes. But 10 minutes for three, it's good. Okay, so we're gonna have the last, uh, the last one because we want to make sure we have enough. It's probably more than enough. Okay. Oh. Oh, it give hearts now. This one actually give you hearts. Usually they don't give heart, but because it was a critical success, I got also heart. Because if we go see here, I have the same potion that I did with the same item. The first one, see? Just one butterfly and three uh, critter item. And then the same item. So if you one the butterfly and three critter item, all of the same item. And because this one here was a... There's a chance to have a critical success, you know. And this one also have heart. So we'll keep it like, you know, in case we need hearts. Uh, so that's a good one. Now, what else could I, could we make? Um, I still want to make food, but I also might want to make potion. Uh, but if we check here, we have this year increase movement speed. So this is good for when you want to climb up, for example. Uh, so I'm gonna put it with it's a it's a mushroom. So an omelet would be great. Could try with fish. Um, I wonder what'll happen if I just put that. We have to try. We're scarce, it would fail and it would look like. Okay, three minutes, for three minutes, I'm gonna climb faster and we have a few heart. Well, I mean, my goal is not to have a lot of heart because I just only have three heart. So that's okay. Uh, it was three minutes, so let's, let's try it again. The same items. Just out of curiosity. Oh, critical success. Okay, three minutes. But now we have like more than five heart. So, food is, is way better. It's really for, you know, much more for, you're gonna get much more success in terms of, you know, how many hearts it's gonna, you know, give you back. Food, it's, it's like you're healing. Um, but when it comes to... When it comes to potion, it's more about uh, the effect. You're gonna have much, much more success with the effect. All right, now for the fun of it, we're gonna try one, but we're gonna have more items. So an egg, a fish. Uh, what could work with this? I know this is gonna be more hell, but we could try this and this. There. <laughs> Another critical success. Jeez. I'm lucky. Oh, look at that. Nine minutes of going faster. And we have seven heart. That's good. We're going to try it again. It doesn't mean it's going to be a success, but it seems to be uh, working. Okay, so if it's not a success, you get kind of half. The time, but still the and the same number of the time, half of the time of the speed boost, but as many heart. That's good. Okay, so when it comes also to food, we don't necessarily need to have something for it, like something that would, um, what's the word? Something that would uh, give you a bonus stat. Uh, but we, sometimes it's kind of nice to just let's try an apple crab. If if I can do it, I don't know if it's gonna work. But I love. I remember my mother used to make these like crab pancake, you know, but or crab 
crab in French <laughs> with apple, and it was so good. Oh, look at all um, mini hearts now I'm doing. So original dish made by steaming near uh, rip, rip, ripen, whatever um, fruit in the leaves of fragrant uh, plant, and this this must be tasty. This must be freaking good. Um, let's try to make a mushroom one. Just just a mushroom. Uh. Crepe or omelette. Let's try them. <laughs> there you go, an omelette. Three R. Cool. And we have more. Uh, one more. We're gonna add this, but we're gonna get add, add some seasoning to this. I'm trying to really learn more of the recipes, like what is what's gonna do what. Okay, well now we have four hearts. So adding another ingredient went from three heart to four heart. I think we're we have a pretty good amount of stuff, but in terms of elixir though, we have some good stuff also. Like this here, we have the beetle, the beetle uh, that would give us um, attack power. I'm gonna put two because it's my last wing. I want to see if it's gonna do anything. Uh, cool. So if I drink this, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit harder. For fun. Plus we have hearts now. Cool. And then we have speed boosting. So if I oh I have another one. Wait, I thought I only had one. Wait, does critical actually give you back some of your item? You don't know, but I'm okay with that. I really, I really thought I had. Did I really have water? Okay. Uh, so more speed. Uh, five minutes. Uh, I never had the same item. I, I think it's useless. So I'm gonna do another speed potion. Okay, just five minutes. So having two, um, two of the same critter so far seems to did not did not give me uh, more. Um, what's the word? More um, more time for the potion to uh, to work. Elixir, actually. So what I think it does it. I mean, that's my theory. What I think it does is it actually uh, increases your chance of critical. The more item from the same thing that you had. So I think it, it increases your critical chance of having a critical success and like maybe double the, uh, the effect or like for an elixir having speed on it. See, we have also, I should have thought about that because here I have also a critter here. The frog is also speed boost. I could have had this with uh, the lizard to had another another item. So, but I forgot about it. So, uh, what if we do this? So I I had one, two, um, and just two of these. I don't need to do every app to make everything, but it's always good to have more item with you. So, and also we have the silent one. I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna do one, two, three. So, I'm hoping this is what's gonna happen. Like, having three of these with some critter part is gonna increase my chance of doing a critical success. I think this is what it is. 14 minutes. Increasing your... Uh, that, that's that's amazing. So, uh, okay. We're, we're out of most... Yeah, we're out of mostly everything. So I'm just not going to make anything else for the moment. Okay. Uh, can I put it away? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we're good to go. We are good to go. It's time to go up to um, the other side. 
So it told us how to make uh, how to make the tree fall where we want. And to make this, you have to turn your hip towards where you want it to fall. So I want it to fall this way. So um, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah. And it works. There you go. I could still take more the wood because uh, you never know when you're going to need some. A single swing of this giant sturdy leaf can create a gust of wind strong enough to blow away light object. Uh, these will sometimes fall off trees as they're chopped. So this is good. That means that I'll be able to... Um, it's like if you, if you see a raft, for example, you can use this to create a wind. That's great. I think this is going to be enough of uh, wood. Ah, oh, yeah. Bye. I'm going for this, uh, the other one. The other... Um... Go. Oh. Okay, let's not fall. I'm going for the, uh, the third shrine. Okay. We have some... Uh... Probably surprise one with a edge shot. Ah, shit. Oh! No, I didn't want it to do that, but it's too late now. Alright, let's, let's fight. Oh! Let's go! Okay, body damage. I'm just gonna use this one then. There we go. Oh, there's a apple here. I'm gonna take them. And this is a uh, Boko Spear. Spear, uh, I'm not gonna say that word, carved from a large tree branch. Uh, it looks like its original intent was for skewering meat. Yeah, and cooking it, okay. But it does have some combat merit as well. Well, I don't really need this, so I'm just gonna drop it. What if I hit this? No, it's not enough. Oh wait, no, they do fall, but it takes time. So might as well eh, cut the tree. Get all of the apple. All of the apple. Alright. Okay, so this here. Okay, there's something here, so let's 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 throw. <laughs> A bam. Go we'll see what's in there. Oh yes, yes. All right, and now I know that if I if I remember correctly, last time I did it, there's a pad right here, tons of spot to stop. Yes, yeah, see, and you follow the the mushroom. So we're gonna drink a a speed potion. Three minutes should be good. Oh yeah. Four minutes. I don't want to take uh no, I just want to take these, not not a um not the with the food until I need the food. I could eat that though. Alright, so now we're gonna be faster. Let's do this. Yeah, I have a speed up for four minutes. Five minutes. And if I ever need some uh, stamina, I have some potion and food, so we're good. I don't think we're gonna need it, but just in case. And we're gonna try to get these mushrooms at the same time. I think those are rush room, which means that's what's help you, you know, create elixir that make no food that makes you go faster. So we're gonna collect them at the same time. Oof. 
Oof. I'm not a fan of height. Sadly, no matter what I do in real life, if 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 I was right there next to this, I would just feel dizzy. There's like nothing I can do about it. It sucks. But hey. You learn you learn to live with it. You know, and be careful. Because you don't want to you, you you don't want to fall, so. Two. Let's keep a good watch on our go. Now I guess at this point oh wait, this way. Uh, I'm just trying to stop at every little uh So I'll have to decide where I'm gonna put my first uh, all my spirit orb and the first place where I'm gonna put them. And me, usually I put them on hard first. Like I'm trying to regain a much more, many much more hard, and I use potions of like that for stamina if I need to. Because I don't want to. Right, Owadaim Shrine. Do this. That face on the top. Looks like they're there. Sticking your the tongue out. be this next challenge oh yeah it's the stopping time to set your foot in this shrine i am awadaim in the name of the goddess i offer, offer this trial St stasis trial this is gonna give us a the um the new rune i also haven't tried any of my my card yet but i'm wait. i, I I don't want, to, you know, my my uh, amiibo card, whatever it. I don't want to use them right right now because I feel they would be kind of almost kind of cheating. I don't know why. The fact that you have to buy either amiibo card or, um, what do you call them? Uh, the amiibos themselves, and that it give you an advantage. You know, uh, we're gonna try some from time to time, just to see what it's gonna do. I mean, it's the goal to use them, but at first, at the beginning, I just didn't want to use them like all in one shot and and get too much of an advantage. Okay, so, stasis. Stop the flow of time for an object. Stop an object in time while storing its kinetic energy. The store energy will act upon the object when the flow of time resumes. Making good use of the store energy can move even the largest object. So, if you never played this, what happened is that you can stop object, but you can also keep them in place, and you hit them. And all the hit that you hit the the item, it's gonna kind of like have this force to uh, when it's gonna be uh, stopped from this uh, the stasis is gonna stop. It's gonna have all of this force of of hitting it and trying to push throw it away. So. You'll see right there, I'll do it in a moment, so... Alright, so here, we want to do that. Whoa, I almost fell, jeez. There you go. Okay, like th this here, we want to stop it on its way. Ah! I just realized that it was on a timer. Quick, get out of there! Get out of there! Oh my god, I just realized it wasn't a timer. Um, Jeez, these food are just too good. I thought I made, yeah, I thought I made some anomaly or something like that that had few arts. They increase in, oh no, there, there they are. Okay, just simple food. There you go. Alright. Alright, 
So if I do this, another one's not gonna fall down until. Uh... Oh, a traveler shield. Uh, I'm gonna have to drop one of these old I mean, cheap shield, I guess. Uh, let's see. Hammer is this is this is what we want. Oh yes, we definitely want that. So do I have anything that I wouldn't need want to keep for now? I think I'm full, right? Iron sledge hammer. So this large iron sledge hammer was originally used for mining, but it worked reasonably well as a weapon too. I keep them for actually usually actually mining mining or if I need to hit an object very hard with stasis. It, it works so great. Okay, too many weapons, so we're just gonna throw this one. Bye. There you go. So this is where I, what I meant with the stasis and 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 putting power into it. So now you hold this and then see there's an arrow, and wherever this is gonna go, the more I hit, the the harder it's gonna go that way. There we go. So this is a good way to get something out of the way. And voila. Voila. Third shrine. Go to third shrine. Smile upon you. 